Come on, keep it together. Oh my god, one more fucking hit. Holy shit, I actually did it. This might be the furthest I've ever come in this game. Good evening, guys, and welcome to this gem worth of a game, which, let's be honest, we've all played this game when we were younger, and I just, I was literally on YouTube when I saw a advertisement for this game, or like the Swords and Sandals 4 or whatever being in discount, and I was like, man, I should totally play this again. And yeah, I just pulled up my GeForce experience, started the recording, and here we go. We're gonna make a, yeah, returning save later. Okay, we, we're gonna have to create a new one. And we're gonna, okay, let's, okay, let's, let's start with naming him something badass. All right. Now let's, let's, um, oh boy. Oof. Okay, well, let's just give him that cooked chicken color. Looks good to me. Let's make him fabulous. Where's the pink? Okay, there is no pink. We're just gonna have to go with purple. I guess it's kind of pinkish. Okay, what are we? What are we gonna make him good at? I remember the OG strat was to be just going through strength, but let's actually try to be smart about this. Let's give him one more into defense. Let's. Be, Muffin is gonna be defensive. Okay. Muffin, Muffin. Yes, that was your name. But it seems an eternity since anyone has called you that. And now here you are, languishing in the darkness, a forgotten prisoner in the Emperor's dungeon. Ugh. A door opens and your eyes are blinded by the light. Dark shapes appear before you. Soldiers? What do we actually do? Hey, get up, you warm! Intones a voice. It is time. You are heard from your cell in an underground area with several other prisoners. A massive guard in the dark armor. Okay, well. Those who survive will become gladiators, he says. Hang in each of your rusty knife. There is no... El okay, well, great. In frenzy of blood and with the stench of your days as a gladiator begin. Hell yeah, guys. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Do you feel it? Do you feel that feeling of being old now? Because I do. Let's fuck this guy up. Insane. Uh, let's give him... Let's actually give him some strength so that we do some more damage. Let's give him like two in strength. Let's give him one more vitality and one more defense. Sounds very strategic to me. Now watch me just die in the first tournament. Because that's like the hardest thing to do. Okay, now, now I'm gonna show you the OG strat, right? We're gonna go into armory. Get the best boots. Alright. And we also get the best greaves. Right now we leave. And we get the magic shop. We give ourselves the max enchanted weapon because that's for free here. And now we're gonna go into the air arena. And we're just gonna duel people until we find someone who has no armor. And then we're gonna absolutely wreck that bitch. Oh, well, that did not go great. Nice. Alright. First blood to muffin. That just sounds badass. Pretty good. Oh, whoa. Well. A merchant's car has fallen over and the goods are spilled everywhere. A crowd of people has gathered around. The merchant is obviously struggling. Do we help him out or sneakily steal some of his goods? Nah, we help him out. You spend some time repairing the car. The grateful merchant thanks you and gives you 150... Oh, thank you. Why would you be a douche and try to steal from him? There we go. Easy business. Now we're gonna we're gonna get as much gold as possible before the tournament. Oh, look at this! Right off the bat, we get some. See, that's that's why you enchant your weapon. Um, Holy shit! Oh my god! Okay, that was close. Okay, well I think I'm ready to lose. Let's go for it. Oh, easy! Hit him in the stomach and his head fell off. That's how much of a champ Muffin is. Oh, this guy. Easy. Literally fell apart. Oh boy. Boss fight time. We're gonna lose to this guy. It's like insanely difficult to beat him. I remember that. Holy shit, is he badass though. 
Well, look at look at him. He has because he has, he has less health than we do, but he has twice the armor, and he has a much stronger weapon. Douche. Man, I want that headband. It's look. It would look so good on Muffin. We can do this. He's oh, almost dead. If I die now, I swear to God. Come on, keep it together. Oh my God, one more fucking hit. Holy shit, I actually did it. This might be the furthest I've ever come in this game. We've won the Wool Ridge's Meat Emporium Cup. The Emperor Antares has granted me 10,000 gold pieces. Wow. What a champ. And sick. Easy. This game is actually easier than Metro. How about that? The hour is late and the town... Uh... Quiet and see. you find yourself growing very will you brave the streets or spend some gold filling a tavern to rest for the night now you see this is a trick because you would think that braving the streets is actually a better idea but I know that I know for a fact that if you do this you're gonna actually lose all your gold so we're just gonna find the bed in the tavern you make your way to the cozy nook a tavern in the merchant's quarter paying the innkeeper tw uh, 250 gold pieces you are shown to a comfortable room with a view of the forests to the east your sleep is peaceful and you wake feeling ready to take on the world again. Awesome. Whoa. Holy sh... Jesus Christ, this guy was ready. I also love that little nipple he has going on on top of his head that is just... <clears throat> very nice. It's time to battle the evil ninja, man. Achilles the Philosophical, Phaeton, and Captain Maybor. Alright. Poke time. <laughs> Love how the little poke just tore him apart. From waist down. Or, oh, I didn't even read this. He's, a, he's held at the height of summer and attracts travelers from across the realms of Brandor. One of the festival's highlights is the Midsummer Blades, a tournament up for up and coming gladiators such as yourself. Uh, I thought I already was a gladi gladiator, but alright. Okay, the Muffin vs. the Evil Ninja. Shit. Oh my god, this guy is tough. Ah! <laughs> Easy business. This was 17,500 gold pieces. Damn. Rich bitch. I just blocked that with my mind. That's my secret, guys. I, I can use the force. Okay, well, let's tournament, I guess. Son of Stellonius. Okay. Too bad you got that nice shiny sword, but you can't block for shit. Horus the Lazy Eyed. Just to poke away from death. Here we go. Oh, this guy. Another boss. No. I'm not I'm not feeling too good about this one. Well hey, we have more health and almost as much armor, but look at the weapon he has, Jesus. Oh my god. I have one tiny Yep that That sure did Oh my okay. Holy fuck shit. 90 damage? Oh my god, the damage he's doing to me. Insane. No, oh, it's not looking good. 50. He does. A f he gives me 50 damage with a quick attack. Okay. It's it's this. It's now we're in fucking. Okay, well you know what. It was a good run. That has to end sometime. There's no way we're beating him at this point. He has way more than. Okay, well. Well, you know, if I. Okay. Hey. Well. And so it was that your days as a gladiator came to an end. 
27 wins and one loss. Well guys, I think that's a pretty good score to end on. And I think that's where we are gonna end this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Travel back to your childhood and nostalgia. And maybe not even childhood. <laughs> it matters how old you are. But anyway, if you enjoyed, make sure to check back in for more. And I will make sure to do more. For now, I wish you a good rest of this evening. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.